So today is Friday, the, the 19th of December 2025. So our underground tank is almost complete. However, we would like to know in this particular video what is the capacity? What is the capacity of water this particular underground tank would be able to store for us? Then how much did we spend in this particular underground tank and our chicken 1000 bears how many days or how many weeks how many months will our 1000 bears be able to drink water full of this particular tank so we are going to be doing various calculations to be able to determine all of this so we start with how much we spent in constructing this particular tank so we started with the digging of the pits which we spent 2500 Ghana cities then we bought cement for the casting of 300 pieces of blocks and which was also 1500 Ghana cities then we um, did laying that is construction of the of the blocks which is also 350 Ghana cities then we bought aggregate sand to do the construction of the blocks which is also 1200 Ghana cities then the block works the construction of the using the blocks to construct the work which is also 500 Ghana cities that is the workmanship then we did uh, um, block works the cements and then uh, that is a block work cements which is also 2500 Ghana that's about 25 bucks of cement that we use then we also bought um, steel steel and wood to do the various coverings for the concrete that one too is 800 Ghana cities then the plastering works then we also have the rental of various items the tank among others 200 cities then food and water for the workers that one to 200 Ghana cities then water water to do the construction of everything that one too is 200 Ghana cities so we also bought rubbers rubbers to lay it on the ground floor before the concrete work then also uh, layers then also the quality sheet to cover the various size before we fill it back that that one to 100 cities and then 240 Ghana cities then we're having this plastering works and then we are going to do um, covering of it so that one is not part of it so all these that i've mentioned 200 2500 1500 350 1200 500 ghana cities 2500 for blocks uh, for cement also 800 ghana cities 200 for renters 200 for food and water 200 for water for the works then also quality sheets among others so all of this put together we have gotten 10,050 ghana cities so we are here to put concrete on top of this or we will roof it so whichever we do that that cost will come and add to this so on the average we spend 10,000 Ghana cities on this particular tank but what is the volume what is the volume of this particular tank what volume of water how many liters of water would this particular tank be able to hold so to do that one we'll have to do a calculation of the width the length and then the depth to find out what volume of water this particular tank can carry having spent 10,000 Ghana cities in it so to find to find the volume of water that this particular tank will be able to carry so we first of all get the the, the length of the tank we get the length which is six feet six feet is the length then we have the the width which is also 4.7 feet then we calculate the depth also the depth is 9 feet so since there are two chambers we calculate it and multiply it by 2 so we calculate the, the depth the length and then the width multiplied by 2 so we will get around 14,000 and above so let's say 14,000 so this particular tank that we spend more than 10,000 Ghana cities on is 14,000 capacity 14,000 liter capacity of underground tank and this is really good for us but to know whether we should be happy or not we have to check how many days will 1,000 bears be able to drink 14,000 liters of water so according to research dry season during the heat season a grown-up hen will drink 0 0.25 milliliters of water per day and then during the wet season or during times like this cold like this they drink 0 
1.20 milliliters of water per day. So now, now that there are 1,000 beds, so how many liters of water will they be able to drink per day? So you have during um, cool season 0.20 milliliters times 1,000, and this will give you 200 liters of water per day. So during the heat season, you have 0.25 milliliters of water per hen times 1,000 of them. So this will give you 250 liters of water per day. So now we have 14,000 liters of water in this underground tank. So how many days or how many weeks will 1,000 bears be able to drink the whole of this water? Should they drink, let's say, 250 liters of water per day? So to be able to tell how many days our 1,000 bears will drink this 14,000 liters of water, then we take the 14,000 liters divided by 250, that is the upper side, 250. Our bears drink 250 liters a day, that is the upper side. So 14,000 divided by 250, and we are going to get 56 days. That is very good for us, 56 days. So that is almost two months. So we spent 14, uh, we spent 10,000 uh, Ghana cities to construct 14 liter capacity, 14,000 liter capacity, and our best 1,000 will drink it for almost two months. And this is really great for us. And we couldn't have bargained for anything less. The other thing now left is for us to get water, to get water consistently filling this particular tank. And I'm hoping that our water from Ghana Water Company will flow so that we will be able to get water into this. And that will be very good for our project. Thank you so much. If you haven't subscribed to my Ghanaian Dream channel, please do so to follow us to get all the details we are sharing about our project. Remember, I invested 100,000 Ghana cities into 1,000 beds. And I want to see whether I'll be able, I will be able to make some money from it to make my life better in Ghana and not any other place. So see you tomorrow.